Yo, what is up, you guys? Brian here from Bang Out Volleyball. Today we're going to be watching uh, episode 12, Let the Games Begin, of season 2 of Q. Again, if you guys are new here, subscribe, like the video, all that good stuff. Let's just get started with the video. Here we go. No shoes allowed. The tournament's happening. The Baichi. Kirigawa Daichi. Oh. Mm. They're gonna have a good day today. でも殺すのってあんま Oh my gosh, did he eat? Did he get any sleep? Oh, he's nervous. He usually gets nervous. What's interesting is I've always had this where like I would get really nervous at tournaments that I just could not eat the whole day. But I gotta remember at least to stay hydrated. So hopefully he's doing that at least. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, everyone's nervous. They're just such goofballs, man. There we go. Bathroom, bathroom. Oh, what the heck, dude? That's so rude. Oh, that's a team they beat, like, easily. Wow, the disrespect, dude. Short and loud. Got the eyes, man. Got him intimidated. Dang. They just give you that look, man. Oh, hitting lines. Wow, dude, they talk a lot of smack. Karasuna better destroy them. Tanaka, bro. Yeah, dude, they destroyed this team in the beginning. Ogi Minam Minami? 
Let's see if that team, if Minami, Minami's team got a lot better. Don't, you never want to underestimate a team. You still want to play your absolute best. That is true. Jeez, they got some good offense now. What? Higanami still got 11 points. <gasps> the faint. Oh my god, he read it like a textbook. That's how you know they've gotten way better. Nice up. Oh my god, they can read them easily. I love that I love the animation because they've really designed it where you can really read and like see how the players are growing. So this is really cool to watch. Yep, they got to see different things. Oh, sorry, guys. Seeing a lot of different moves allows them to see the court differently or easily. Nice. Wow, absolutely destroyed a team that's talking smack the whole time. Oh, backstory. Jeez. We still haven't seen this guy even play yet. Gosh, dude, that pisses me off. At least put some effort into it like that guy. More backstory.
ありがとうなお前らはもともとガタイもセンスもいいんだし頑張れよああ、it's rough it's it's rough because usually the captains you know if, especially if the teams aren't run by like a coach and let's say you have like i don't know like for college a club team that you're running and you see how like their president or the captain puts so much extra effort again their students so they're not getting paid for any of this like at the end of the year you know they realize they put so much freaking work in this club that they didn't get that far it really it really like makes the captain realize like dude i put all this work in and it wasn't hard enough like do people do do, do my teammates even care uh that i'm working this hard like i put so much time and effort and stress into this that we just lost in the first round of playoffs or, or whatever the situation is so I, i've definitely felt this before um so it's 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 really hard it's it's a really tough feeling to have Oh, nice up. Oh my gosh. Well, that was a change of pace. Jesus. Gotta remember, this is still about Karasuno. Oh my gosh. Yeah, express yourself. Work hard, bro. We got a bunch of Tsukashimas on Oginami. Oh, it seems like this is the type of coach that's just like, oh yeah, just have just have a lot of fun. But you know, you're not doing them a favor. You want to compete. Spirit. Hey. Make the universe go your way. Let's go, Tanaka. You show them smack talking teams.
Yo, this whole time, what has Oganami been doing to work hard? It's just, just, I feel like they've just been holding themselves back recently. And I regret how much we didn't... Yeah, there you go, I just said it. My gosh. It's like I've watched this before, but I haven't. That's what I thought, so let's get... Oh, the disrespect. That, that's a true thing, though. That is a true thing. Sometimes you hear about that stuff, which absolutely sucks. Oh. Oh, not this again. Come on, bro. You said you wanted to beat Shira Torizawa. Oh my, oh my gosh, that hurts. Oh wow. Oh my gosh. Wow, what a save. Oh, what's up? Oh, he got that up. It did not look like it was perfect. Oh my gosh. Hinata's just on another level, bro. Jeez. They're just on another level. Doesn't matter how hard Oginawa works. Let's go. Let's go. Wow, I got the feels because of the song. Quickest match I've ever seen. Literally like two rallies. Damn, who do they play next? They're going home. Dang, imagine just going to a tournament, losing first round, you gotta go home. That's rough, man. The school's gotta pay for that. My chest is itchy. Nine thirty already. Dang. But continue to work hard. Dang. All right, let's see uh, who Karasuna plays next. Oh, wait. What? Oh, is it Lev? Bro, is this Lev? Oh, it's not Lev. It's someone else. That, usually in tournaments, there's always that really big guy that stands out that intimidates everyone. This is probably one of those players. It's a weapon. His height is a weapon. Looks goody. What?
Kagugawa versus Karasuna. Yeah. Jeez. Two meters? Isn't that like... That's... I, I don't even know. Like 6'5 or something? Jeez. Oh, like Hello Kitty? It's a Pikachu! <laughs> oh my gosh. Don't break down again, Hinata! Oh my gosh. <laughs> that's that's a good response from Kagayama because I actually do give that response to some of my teammates on the court where like if I hear them and they're they're like very nervous it's like really that scared bro like the game the thing is with volleyball the game and the momentum really changes and it's like you just kind of go with the flow and if you can go with the flow the game becomes a lot smoother but I understand like people do get anxiety and get really nervous, so you can't really put that put their feelings aside. You gotta acknowledge it at least. It's finally about to start. Let's see how they do with a big guy. That is true. It really doesn't matter because usually sometimes the ace only gets like two kills because everyone knows that that's, that person's the ace and they put so much defense on him that let's say in the game, like, dude, he only bounced one ball. Like, why are you guys scared? Like, everyone else needs to be, you know, calm and on the same page and... Think clearly, I guess, but it's hard when you're in the moment. So I get it. Oh my gosh, they're leaving me with this cliffhanger, and we gotta watch the next episode. Anyway, if you guys are new here, subscribe, like the video, all that good stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace!